Uh, what's up everybody? Daniel Sun here. I don't usually do comparison reviews, but I've decided that I'm going to do a comparison review um, between the original fragrance and a clone of the original fragrance. And I chose to do a comparison between Polo by Ralph Lauren and a clone of Polo Ralph Lauren um, is by a, a house or a company called Bell Cam. They do fragrances. Um, it's a line called Classic Match. They do clones of Polo, Sauvage, Drek Arnor, Aventus. They do all kinds of clones. Um, but they are actually a very decent clone company. Actually, I think they're one of the best. Um, I don't know the official notes to this. They, I, I couldn't really find anything online if they were identical to the notes as far as like Polo, but I'll give you the notes to Polo. Um, Artemisia, basil, thyme, cumin, coriander, cloves, Chamomile. I think this is actually the only fragrance that I have that has chamomile in it. Um, patchouli, oak moss, vetiver, leather, tobacco, and thyme. Now I've had this for the majority of my life since, I don't know, the 80s sometime. And I've always loved this fragrance. And one of the reasons I always loved this particular fragrance is because it's so, it's so fresh and green and crisp and outdoors it smells like walking in a forest um, it's like pine and oak moss and green grass and cloves and it's just so outdoors it's so woody and fresh and green it makes me feel energized and I just love it it's so much different from you know most of the other fragrances that I have and I just I think it smells so good it's just really energizing to me and I think it's a beautiful fragrance um, so I've been wearing I've been wearing this for a long time and I've always wore it separate and I've I've actually wore this separately too um, but the last three days, um, I've been really, really comparing them side by side. I've always wore this on my, um, this is where I usually put fragrances. I've been wearing polo on my left arm for the last three days. And at the same time, I've been wearing the classic match polo clone on my left arm. Um, and just comparing them. I spray them exactly at the same time. Um, I take mental notes. What does it smell like in the initial opening? In the opening, does it? do I smell a particular note more in one fragrance than the other? How is it developing between the two? Do I, I've done the same thing in the mid. How does it smell? Is it? Does it smell the same? Is there any difference whatsoever? Same in the dry down. Um, so I really am like digging to find any kind of difference whatsoever um, in these in these fragrances side by side. Um, and I've been doing this for three days, every single day for three days. And I've been really digging, really digging. Is there any difference, any difference whatsoever? In any of the notes, in any of the smell, in the quality, in the longevity, the projection. And my conclusion is this and this are identical. I mean, literally identical. There is no difference. I can't tell the difference. And I've been really, really like, really really straining to like find any difference and there is no difference whatsoever it's like it's actually like bell cam actually took a bottle of polo and poured the fragrance in this bottle 
that's how identical they are. There is no, there is no other clone that is so identical to the original that I've ever smelled in my entire life. The next one, the next one would have to be um, Shades Blue by Armoff, which is a clone of Blue Day Chanel. I actually thought that, that I couldn't get any closer as far as a clone in the original than that, than the Shades Blue by Armoff. Um, but this actually beats that clone as far as like, you know, comparing it to the original fragrance of what it's trying to, to clone. Um, this is, there is no difference whatsoever. Um, and I've really tried. I No, I don't hate to say that. Um, but I'm very fond of, you know, Polo by Ralph Lauren. I, I have an attachment to this, so I wish I could say that this was better, better quality, you know, and all that. But I, I'm not going to do that because if I do that, it's going to be a lie. So the truth is there is no difference whatsoever between the two. Um, everything's perfectly identical. Artemisia, basil, thyme, cumin, coriander, leather, tobacco. It's, it's exactly the same thing. It's like polo is in this bottle. Um, the only difference is, is the price. This is like four times as much. I think a hundred mil of this is like 50 something dollars. And this is like 15. So the only difference is, is the price. And uh, I'll put the link in the description on where you can get this. And I'll put the link in the description on where you can get this. You can actually drive down to your local Walmart and get this for like 10 or 15 bucks. You don't even have to go online. Just go to Walmart and they got a ton of these. Wow, I can't believe I just said that. But I feel good because it's the truth. So I have no problem in saying what I just did. Um, but I do want to say something that a lot of people are not going to understand. These, I will have a supply of the polo smell for probably the next couple of years. But when I run out of these, do you know what I'm going to buy? Even though they smell exactly the same, I'm going to buy Polo, even though it's four times as much. I'll tell you why. Because I support I support the original houses. Ralph Lauren is the one who come up with this to begin with, so they should get credit for it. And I don't know, there's just like an attachment to certain houses and even though this is exactly the same thing clone houses clone houses have their place in the fragrance community they really do i'm glad i'm thankful for clone houses but i'd rather buy i'd rather buy this because i want to put my support to the to the house itself the original house because clones hurt houses some more than others but they still if everybody buys this and nobody is buying this then that's going to hurt Ralph Lauren it is it's going to hurt them so I'd rather spend four times as much money and buy something from Ralph Lauren than this that's just my personal opinion a lot of people will understand and a lot of people will not understand my decision on that but that's my personal opinion and choice that's just how i am i'm going to put my money into the house into ralph lauren so anyway i hope y'all got something from this and um i love you guys and i'll talk to you later peace see ya